In this video, we will continue with implicit differentiation. You will find this on page 497 in the Namibia AS level mathematics textbook Y equals MX plus C to success. Let's look at another example. Find dy over dx of 2 e to the power xy plus e to the power 2 xy to the power 3 equals 8. Okay, so we're going to use the product rule in both terms, in that term as well as in that term. And we sit with the e to the power of x or 2x. Okay, so I'm going to start. I rewrite the first one. I differentiate the second one. And remember, as soon as I differentiate to y, I write dy over dx. Then I write the second one and I differentiate the first one. Okay. And then the next term, I write the first one, differentiate the second one. Don't forget your dy over dx. Then write the second one, differentiate the first one, and then differentiate to 8. Okay, and now I'm doing this. So this, this y becomes 1. This is the y, okay? And this is going to, um, if I differentiate this, it just stays 2e to the power x. Okay, I rewrite this one. I differentiate this one. So it's going to be 3y squared dy over dx. And then it's going to be y3. And if I differentiate this one, don't forget, 2 that's why it's 2, and then it's this stays the same, e to the power 2x. Okay, and then I just simplify, just a stripe there. Okay, so as soon as I simplify, I mark the terms with dy over dx. And I mark the other terms without that. Okay, so take dy over dx out as a common factor. Okay, I'm taking it out, so I'm left with this. And I'm left with this. I take this over. I take this over. And then I divide. I divide. And then I'm taking out. You can take two. It's not going to make a difference. But the only thing that can cancel is e to the power x. And I'm left with this. So it can either be multiplied in or it can just stand as this. Okay. I want you to stop the video. And I want you to do number B. Again, you can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, right, let's start. Okay, so in this case, I rewrite the first one and I differentiate just want to make it correct. I differentiate to the second one, and as soon as it's y, I write dy over dx plus then it's going to make y more space. Then I'm writing the second one and I differentiate the first one. And then, this is just staying, because it's just 2x, so that's my first. And then my second, I write the first one, and I differentiate to the second one. And don't forget, dy over dx, as soon as it's 2y. Okay, and then, still make space, I write the second one and I differentiate to the first one. Okay, and then this is finished. I just differentiate to the 80 and in terms of x. Okay, and now I'm going to start. So if I start with this one, I'm first going to do all the differentiation. So I, this is just staying the same. Multiply 2y, get the pin correct, 2y, okay. And don't forget your dy over dx. Plus uh, this one, and then this one, 
and then plus this one <clears throat> and this is just going to be one but don't forget your dy over dx and then it's going to be y to e to the power of x and then it's just going to be zero okay and now i'm going to simplify so this is going to be 10 and it's going to be e to the power x y and it's going to be dy over dx and this is going to be 5 and it's going to be y squared and it's go okay let's just make the e before the y so just to get the order the same and then y squared this is going to be 2 e to the power x dy over dx plus 2 e to the power x y and that's 0 now I'm just going to mark all my terms with dy over dx and all my terms without and I'm going to take it to the different sides. Okay, so I'm going to take out dy over dx and it's going to be 10 e to the power xy plus uh, th this one 2 e to the power x okay and I take this over so it's negative 5 e to the power of x y squared minus 2 e to the power x y okay then I divide by this so it's 10 e x y plus 2 e x divide 10 e x y plus 2 e x and now all the terms is having e x so basically I'm just going to now take out e to the power of x and then it's negative 5 y squared minus 2 y over e to the power x and 10 y plus 2 and then this cancel and my final answer will be negative 5y squared minus 2y over 10y plus 2. And that will be my final answer.